we present RealFeel, a new worn haptic system for use in virtual and augmented reality capable of rendering complex kinesthetic and tactile effects. Our device's low cost frees the hand by distributing weight to the body, could be battery powered, and can render many different haptic dimensions in a single device. This includes rigid geometry, haptic animations, impulsive force, compliance, and texture. This stands in contrast to many other haptic systems, which are typically special purpose, often targeting even just a single haptic effect, and cannot be easily combined with other systems. Real feel, however, can render these five different haptic categories in a single device. Our system utilizes gimbal motor reels with strings running to each fingertip. The brushless DC motors we use have a high peak torque, and when we utilize closed loop PID control, we get smooth and fine grained motion. These qualities are critical for both arresting a user's hand in space, while also creating more subtle effects such as textures. Effects can be felt independently for each finger, and motor reeling is automated for fluid and responsive haptics. Many of our effects are rendered by varying the voltage applied to the motors, which in turn continuously varies the force felt by the fingertips. Here you can see a user interacting with different objects and surfaces in a virtual scene. Each finger collision is handled independently, conveying gross surface geometry. Note that the users can translate their hands across the surface, and the fingers correctly follow the object's contours. We can even simulate tool-mediated collisions, such as this hammer hitting an anvil. Additionally, virtual objects can exhibit animated haptic effects upon static touch contact, such as vibrations from this running washing machine, or when operating this power sander. We also consider event-driven reactive forces. For example, a user catching a baseball or firing this sci-fi weapon. In addition to rigid kinematic braking, we can also vary motor torque to realistically simulate material compliance. Nonlinear compliance can be used to create buttons that click or even emulate the feeling of a mechanical toggle switch. Finally, by tracking the user's hand, we can enable objects with spatial textures. Here we show examples of wood grain, sand, and foam surfaces. All of these expressive dimensions can be mixed and matched to enable rich haptic VR experiences that prior work could only deliver in part. For instance, this mountain bike handlebar not only vibrates, but jerks the user's arms in response to terrain. For full technical and evaluation details, please see our paper.